Hello everyone. Today we are going to create this sit at home animation tutorial in After Effects. In this tutorial, you will learn how to animate a 2D scene, animating leaves and animating legs in a loop in After Effects. You can download file from freepick.com. Link is given below in the video description. After downloading the file, you need to separate layers in Adobe Illustrator. I have already explained that in my previous video tutorial. Also, I am going to upload weekly motion graphics tutorial in this channel. Make sure to subscribe it. Let's start the tutorial. Drag and drop Illustrator AI file in After Effects. Press OK to this window. Right click to this vector file and click on replace footage with layered comp. Double click this comp. You can see I have separated layers and renamed them accordingly. First we will animate right table layer, then lamp, then flower pot, then leaves, sofa, girl and then in the end these two sceneries. Click on table layer. Press S to open scale. Keyframe it and change its value to 0. Move cursor 19 frames forward and change scale value to 100. Move vector file anchor point position to bottom so that it feels like it is scaling up from the ground. Now I am going to smooth the animation. Select both keyframes, right click, keyframe assistant and then click on easy ease. Select one keyframe, click this graph editor icon. Make sure edit speed graph is marked. Now drag the last keyframe to the left until your graph look like this. Preview it again. Yeah, it's looking good. Make sure you are on the first keyframe, copy table scale value and then select all other layers except background and text layer and paste the scale value to these layers. Now it's time to adjust few things. Click this little circle it will only show that specific layer. Now drag its anchor point to the bottom so it feels like it is appearing from the floor. Now do the same with flower pot. Move leaves anchor point to the bottom so it feels like it is scaling up from pot. Now it's time to animate this sofa. Do the same with the sofa. You can turn on the background layer and can check that the sofa is coming from the floor. Select and move forward leaves layer to the point where pot animation is about to complete. Move its anchor point a little bit lower until it feels like it is coming up from the pot. Uncheck these dots so that all other layers become visible. Let's adjust the girl layer. Move girl layer forward to the point where sofa animation is almost completed. Girl should appear from the sofa surface. Move its anchor point to sofa surface and preview it. Adjust it little bit until you got the desired results. Preview the animation. Yes, it seems fine. We do not need to move anchor point for sceneries as they are already appearing correctly from the wall. Now it's time to adjust timing of layers. 
move sceneries to the end of animation because they will appear in the last. Move lamp sleeve and pot layer forward to the point where right table animation layer is almost finishing up. Move the girl, sofa and wall series to the point where leaves animation is almost finished. Let's animate the text. I'm going to animate it top to bottom. Text layer will appear after scenery's layer. So bring this to the top and make layer forward. Move forward and keyframe position value. Now go to the first frame of this layer and drag text layer to the top so it goes out of the view. Easy is them in the same way. And use graph editor to make it smooth like we did before. It seems little bit fast. Slow it down by dragging last keyframe forward. Now let's animate the leaves. Select this puppet tool and add pinpoints. Now open this layer, open mesh, deform and remove keyframe for this base pin because we do not want to animate this base. Now you need to run a script to animate these leaves. You can download the script from the link that is given below in the video description. Thanks to Anthony for the script. It is too much wavy. You can reduce it by going to effect controls window and reduce amplitude value to 2. Let's animate girl's leg. We are going to create loop animation. Add puppet pins to her feet and on her knee. Let's check if this works. Let's add more puppet points on her body so that it won't move with her feet. Yes, now her feet is moving fine. Let's animate her foot. Go to Mesh, Deform, select her foot puppet point and click on Timer icon to keyframe it. Move forward around 20 frames and move her feet up. Move two frames forward and keyframe again. Move 15 frames forward and copy first keyframe value and paste it. Move 10 frames forward and then keyframe again. Preview it. Yes, looking good. Now it's time to loop her foot animation. Select all keyframes and then click on this timer icon by holding Alt on Windows or Option key on Mac. Click this play icon, then property and click loop out. Let's preview the animation. It's looking perfect. Thank you for watching. See you in next week.